Hey guys, this is Susie. Welcome back to my garden, my beautiful ducklings. In yesterday's video, I was talking about two words to manifest, and those two words are thank you. I know the video got cut off because somebody called to give me some good news about something that they had been working on. And I still went ahead and uploaded the video, but after talking to a few people today, it made me realize that when we say thank you, we're basically saying thank you just for the thing we want. We're saying thank you, I have $2.7 million. Thank you, I have a Camaro. Thank you, Jared is my husband. I, when you guys don't see it off camera, do say thank you for a lot of other things in my life. And it made me think of the Sawyer Brown song, Thank God for You. The lyrics of the song says, um, he thanks mama for the cooking, daddy for the whooping, the devil for the trouble that he got into. He's got to give credit where credit is due. He thanks the bank for the money and thanks God for you. Well, he's thanking everything in his life in that song. He's thanking his mother for the things she did, his dad for the trouble he even got into because he got a whooping. He's thanking the devil because, you know, as Lucifer says, we always blame him for everything we do wrong in our life. He's thanking the bank for the money. He's thanking God for the love of his life. And then the next part, um, at the end of the song with the lyrics, he thanks mama for the loving, daddy for the teaching, the devil for the trouble that he got in too. So he's not just manifesting a life by saying, thank you, I have $2.7 million. Thank you, I have a beautiful Camaro. Thank you, I am married to Jared. He is literally saying thank you for everything. So if you go by, like, this is the greatest day ever, thank you, I'm having an amazing day. Thank you, the uh, hot water was working this morning when I took a shower. Thank you for the hot cup of coffee. Thank you because somebody texted me and said, you know, good morning, beautiful. Thank you because I had a great day at work. Thank you because the stuff I bought at the grocery store was $50 less than I thought it was going to be. When we are manifesting, we focus so much of our day on what we're trying to manifest and we script all day long about the way our lives should be that when you're using those two words that say thank you, we're only thankful for certain things instead of absolutely everything. And we need to focus on all of the amazing things that go on in our life. I'm thankful that I've gotten over the stomach virus. I'm thankful football is on. I'm thankful that I have friends and family. I'm thankful that my car works. I'm thankful I have a beautiful apartment. I'm thankful that my heat works. A couple of weeks ago, they had to replace the heat strips in my furnace. As a result, it was freezing cold and I had no heat. So I was even more thankful because I went out and bought this beautiful fireplace for my living room and it is an electric fireplace so I was able to turn it on for the first time and I shut the studio door and an extra bathroom door that's on an inside wall and it kept the rest of the apartment at 65 degrees. Now most people would say 65, ooh, indoors, that's not good, that's horrible, but I was thankful it was 65 because it was 25 degrees outside without that little fireplace heater it wouldn't have been anywhere near 65 degrees in my apartment i'm thankful that my landlord fixed it immediately for me it was done that day i didn't mentally imagine him fixing it that day i was thankful because anytime something goes wrong he fixes it immediately i am so grateful for the life that I live and I use three ways to manifest and saying thank you is a huge way that I manifest. If you call me, thank you for the great news. If you text me, thank you for the great news. I have amazing clients because they're always texting me that they have amazing news and I'm so grateful what I teach them 
is actually working. My Facebook group, the people that are in my group are learning those same techniques and I'm grateful because they're taking those techniques and they're actually working for them. I'm also thankful that they'll come up with another question in my affirmations that might be better than the question that I am. Everybody manifests at a different level and we're manifesting all day long, 365 days a year. It doesn't change. The thing is, we have to focus on everything we're thankful for when we're using gratitude as a form of manifestation. No matter what tool you use, it's a placebo. It's a tool. And I was reminded that by two different people today, that any tool we use is helping you to get to your desire or you can consider it a placebo. There was an episode of an Andy Griffith show. There was a new pharmacist in town. She wouldn't fill the little old lady's prescription because it was a sugar pill. And she said, it's just a sugar pill. It doesn't help her. She doesn't need it. The little old lady was dying in bed on the couch. Oh my God, I'm so sick, I'm dying. Everybody was bringing her food. And at the end, the pharmacist brought her the pill. She took the pill jumped up off the couch, oh, we've got so much to do, we got all this feed to eat, we've got to do this, we've got to do that, and she was running around because that pill was her thing that made her healthy. Your thing that makes you manifest all day long, you need to amplify that on everything that you do. So no matter what technique you're using, you should be getting success whether it is gratitude, is it wonderful, why, imagining, strictly mental diet. There's a list of the things that we can do to create that dream life. Once we decide something we want, the seed's already been planted. It's done. It's planted. What happens next is simply your focus are you obsessing about it? Are you going to die if you don't get it? Because if you're obsessing and you think you're going to die because you don't get the manifestation, you're not grateful that you're getting the manifestation. If you are going, you know what? I would really love to have this Camaro. And if I get a Camaro, that's amazing. I will be so happy and grateful. But if I don't, I still have a beautiful car that works. And I'm okay with that. When you get to the point that you're okay with having your manifestation and not okay with having your manifestation, that means you dropped it and you don't really need to work on it. So when you think about it, thank you, I got that beautiful Camaro. Thank you, I have $2.7 million in my bank account. Thank you, Jared is my husband. Thank you, I have an amazing life. I always say 10 words or less, you can change your life. Thank you, I have an amazing life. It's seven words, guys. And if you just literally walked around all day long and said, thank you, I have an amazing life, things are going to change because people are gonna hold doors open for you. People are gonna pull out of the parking spot at the perfect time for you to pull into the parking spot that's right outside the door. You're going to get free cups of coffee. You're going to get told you're beautiful. You're going to get the money, the cars, the, the, the love of your life, better relationships. You're going to be more respected, more successful because you're coming from a place that everything in my life is amazing. And when you literally come from a place of my life is, my life is absolutely freaking amazing and I am so grateful for the life that I'm living, only good things will happen for you. So no matter what tool you use to manifest, gratitude should be one in your toolbox. Because saying thank you for little things makes bigger things happen. Saying thank you for bigger things makes even better things happen as well. The more you appreciate your life where it is right now in this second in time, and the more you say, thank you, I'm living an amazing life, that's exactly what you're going to create. So go out there, 
have fun, live your life, script, journal, whatever you do, 5% of your day. But the other 95% of your day, talk about how wonderful your life is and how thankful that you are living an amazing life. And you will watch it change literally overnight. You guys have a beautiful day. And if you get a chance, tell me why you love me. Tell me why you're addicted to me. And tell me why what I'm sharing with you is successful. If you have an idea on what you would like me to help you with, shoot me an email. Make a comment in this video. And I'll be more than happy to do whatever it takes for you to be able to be like me and say, I am so happy and grateful I'm living my dream life. Ten words, guys. That's all it takes to change your entire life. Go enjoy your day. Live it to the fullest. And don't forget to say thank you.